Welcome, everyone, to this beautiful celebration of love as we gather to witness the union of Kathy and John. Today, we are not just here as guests, but as cherished friends and family, celebrating a bond that is truly special. As they embark on this new journey together, let us fill this moment with joy and love. Kathy and John have brought us all together to share in their happiness, and it's a privilege to witness their vows, so, let's open our hearts and enjoy this unforgettable day. AI can serve as a wedding MC or perfectly mimic your voice. It's truly remarkable how AI assists us in so many aspects of life, from enhancing creativity to streamlining tasks. Imagine having an AI that can not only host your special day, but also personalize every moment to reflect your unique style. With AI by our side, we can elevate our experiences, making them more memorable and engaging. Today, I'd like to introduce you to MIF AI, an extremely advanced and customizable voice generation tool. With MIF, you can emphasize certain words, making the voice sound more natural and aligned with your intentions. To get started with MIF Speech Gen 2, the best part is that you can test all of these features for free. Simply visit the MIF.ai website by clicking the card in the top right corner or following the link in the video description. Once you land on the website, click on Open Studio and create a free account. After signing up, you'll be taken to a new project page where you have everything needed to create professional, realistic voiceovers. To get started, you can either upload a script on the left-hand side or type slash paste text directly. I'll paste some text now. This opens a dialog where you can choose how to input your script especially useful for long text readings by a single speaker. If you paste text, a dialog box opens where you can specify how to format it. You can choose to split the script by paragraphs or sentences. This is particularly useful if you have multiple speakers, you can assign a speaker to each sentence. If you prefer to keep the text intact, select Don't Split. For my example, I'll split it by paragraphs and click Paste Script. Next, I need to choose an AI character to read my text. Clicking the icon in the top left opens a variety of speakers, over 120 voices in more than 20 languages. You can filter options by language, gender, age, and voice style to find the perfect match for your project. On the right-hand side, you'll find a variety of speakers, each offering numerous options. Some voices are labeled Gen 2, indicating they are the most advanced and realistic. Go fast. Go far. Go forward. Go to the woods, the mountains, the oceans. To, to weathering its storms. True friendship goes beyond just companionship. It's about trust, loyalty, and unwavering support. Welcome to True Connections, the podcast where we explore the depths of true friendship. Today, we're delving into the essence of what it means to have. Thank you for enrolling. This e-learning system presents you with course presentations that include videos. I just tried some of the voices. The voices were not too bad. I chose this man and selected the angry emotion. Welcome, everyone, to this beautiful celebration of love as we gather to witness the union of Kathy and John. Over here, I think the promo style would be a better fit, so let's go with that. I just wanted to show you how choosing different speaking styles can change the tone and delivery. On the right, you'll see some additional settings. You can adjust the pitch, either raising it higher or lowering it. You can also control the speed making it faster or slower, and even insert pauses into the script. Here, let's click on emphasis. I want to emphasize the word beautiful celebration. Let's listen. Welcome everyone to this beautiful celebration of love as we gather to witness the union of Kathy and John. Today, we are not just here as guests, but as cherished friends and family celebrating a bond that is truly special. It's perfect. 
Now, let's click on this button. This will open a dialogue where I can record myself reading the text. On the left, you can see all the written content, along with a record button. Let's click on the icon and give it a try. You'll likely want to use this feature alongside other elements. For instance, you might want to play some video or add background music, and you can do all of that directly in the studio. On the left side, let's click the Add Media button. Here, you can upload your own audio, music, or video files. Additionally, you can access stock music with a license included in this interface. You can also bring in stock images or videos. One cool feature is the timeline at the bottom, which allows you to place your video alongside the voiceover and add music to enhance the overall experience. While this is a basic video editor that gets the job done, you might prefer to export it to a more advanced program. To export this voiceover, click on the big blue button that says Export. This opens the Export dialog where you can decide what to export. I simply want to export the voice, so I'll select this option. Below, you can configure various settings. For now, I'll stick with the defaults. Over here, let's download the talk track. At the top, I'll click on Download. In the free version, you can't download the voiceover itself, only the script. I'd love to hear your thoughts on the MOF Speech Gen 2 voices, drop your feedback in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.